Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace a spark electrode retaining clip in your gas range, be sure to unplug the power cord or shut off the power supply. Shut off the gas supply as well. Open the oven door and use a Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the screws, securing the control panel's lower cover. Remove the cover. Pull off the five control knobs. Next, unthread the two screws securing the control panel to the frame. Detach the control panel and support it to avoid straining the wires. Now unthread the front bracket screws securing the main top. Unthread the two screws underneath the rear corners of the top. Lift off both grates. Remove all five burner caps and burner bases. You can now unthread the screws securing the orifice holders to the main top. With the screws unthreaded, you can lift off the top. Slide out the old retaining clip if still intact. When installing the new retaining clip, make sure the electrode is properly positioned in the orifice holder. Then slide in the new clip to secure. Reposition the main top on the frame so the spark electrodes protrude through the holes in the top. Confirm that the orifice holders are aligned, then thread and tighten the screws to secure the holders to the main top. Replace each burner base in its proper location by aligning the notch in the base with the spark electrode. Replace the burner caps. Reposition the grates. Thread the two rear screws to secure the main top. Replace the front bracket screws. Realign the control panel on the front brackets. Secure it with the screws.
replace the lower cover. Then thread the screws to secure. Realign the control knobs on the valve stems and push them into place. Note that the power burner control knob should be placed on the second stem from the left. Turn the gas supply back on. Plug the power cord back in or restore the power supply and the gas range should be ready for use.